Hello friends, welcome in today's class. Today we are going to discuss Chapter 12, Simple Machines Part 4. If you like my video please like, share and don't forget to subscribe. At the end of this topic, you will be able to understand. In the previous video of this chapter, we see what is machine, types of machines, and simple machines like inclined plane, a wedge, a lever, and types of levers. Now, let's see the next topic, a pulley. To know what exactly a pulley is, we will do a simple experiment. For this, we required a pencil, sticking tape, an empty reel of thread, half meter, thick thread, a weight such as an eraser, that can be tied to the thread, and play dough. Now, place the pencil on the table, so that, it just over the edge of the table. Fix it tightly to the table, using the sticking tape. Insert the reel, over the part of the pencil, that just out. Put a lump of the play dough on the tip of the pencil so that the reel does not come off. Draw the thick thread having the eraser at one end over this reel. Here you can see that when we lift the eraser tied at the other end, it gets lifted up. Such a device is called a pulley. Now let's see. How does the pulley help us and makes our work easier? When we pull the rope by applying force in the downward direction, the weight is lifted in an upward direction because of which we can easily lift the heavy objects and makes our work easier. So let's define what is pulley. A device with a grooved wheel and thread designed to lift weights is called a pulley. Examples of the pulley are A pulley is used to drop the bucket into the well, collect water, and pull it up again. A pulley is used in a crane to lift heavy machines and collect debris, etc. Now, let's see the next topic, a wheel and axle. All of you must have enjoyed sitting on a giant wheel. What makes the giant wheel go round? Axle of the giant wheel makes it go around, which is fitted to a rod at its center. When the axle starts rotating with the help of electricity, the wheel fitted to it also starts rotating. Can you tell me, when the pedal of a bicycle is rotated, the wheel starts rotating? How does this happen? We know, the wheel of the bicycle, is located on the road, called axle of the wheel. We connect this wheel and pedal, with the help of a chain. Therefore, when the pedal of a bicycle is rotated, the wheel starts rotating. Examples of wheel and axle are, wheels of the bullock cart, door knob etc. In this chapter, we studied, what are simple machines. Now, let's see how to take care of the machines. When we use machines, their parts rub against one another, or the dust settles on it. Due to which, the dusty parts creates more friction. Also, some parts of the machines are affected by weather conditions and get rusted. As a result, machines get damaged or become useless due to such wear and tear. To avoid this, let's see what are the precautions we should take for maintenance of machines. During the maintenance of a machine, all its parts are wiped clean. All or lubricant is released between parts that rub against each other, so that, there is less friction between them, and the wearing is reduced. We should cover the machines, 
when not in use, to prevent dust settling on them. To prevent the effect of weather, metallic parts in a machine are painted externally and the machines are always kept dry. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please like, share and don't forget to subscribe.